Hi everybody, in this week's parsha of Yitro, the Torah tells, that, tells us that Moshe was told to climb Mount Sinai before Hashem revealed the Aserah that he brought in order to receive some initial warnings, initial teachings that he had to then give to the Jewish people beforehand. Amongst the things that Hashem wanted Moshe to teach the Jewish people beforehand was the idea that Hashem expected us to become a Memlechet Kohanim the Goy Kadesh, Goy Kadosh, a kingdom of priests and a holy nation. And then the Torah says, Eile Hadvarim Asher to the Bar of Israel. Moshe, these are the matters that I want you to teach B'nai Israel before I give you the Aserah that he brought. And Rashi comments on the words, these are the matters, and Rashi adds the words, lo pachot v'lo yoter, no more and no less. In other words, Hashem is insisting that Moshe teach this, but exactly the way he received it, not embellishing it and not detracting. But why on this matter of the lesson of holiness does Rashi tell us that Hashem insisted on Moshe being a faithful servant and not adding, not embellishing, and not detracting. The Musar teachers of the past tell us that the message here about the acquisition of holiness is important. Each of us has in our neshamas that element of holiness that's appropriate for us. No more and no less means that if we strive to reach a level of holiness which is not appropriate for us, which doesn't reflect who we can be, if we overreach or God forbid we underreach, that is not God's intention. God wants us to be the best version of ourselves that we can be, the version that makes sense, the version that reflects who we are. Overreaching or underreaching is not that version. Holiness needs to be genuine reflection of who we can be and not a false or inappropriate reflection. It's a Torah thought. It only takes a moment. Shabbat shalom, everybody.